Yeah, now we got it. Take two, as the wife just said. And the uh, GoPro going, but uh, turned on the knockoff, and I forgot to put the chip in it. So I had to go back in, find the chip, put it in the computer, in the uh, camera. Oh. It's the 18th of July. As you can hear, the air conditioning is on already. Let's see here what we got. Let's try again. Nope. Oh, crap. The uh, camera's in the wrong mode. Let's see what happens now. Yep. Now we're working. Alright. It's the 18th of July. It's 7.20. And uh, 70 degrees. The air conditioning's running already. Of course, as you can see, it's a little, little humid. Sunrise was at uh, 501. Sunsets at 815. As days get shorter until winter. Had a problem with the uh, ceiling fan in the bedroom. One of the blades had loosened up pretty good, and uh, the others were all loose. But uh, to get to the screws to hold the blades in, you have to take the lights, the, the uh, Little glass thing that the lights go into, I take that those off. And you take the light fixture down and un unplug it to be able to get access to the screws. So tighten up all the screws and uh, put it back together again, she's fine now. Uh. It's been uh, seven years since I put it up there. I forgot how complicated it was. Uh, don't have enough slack on the microphone. Oh boy. Now well, after I did that, went out to the barn to make a, a bat box. Uh, bats are good for keeping mosquitoes away. We're eating them. We had uh, seen some bats, I think, two years ago. But none since. Got a little hair up here. Little guy. That's where I see him. He's a little one. Hey, buddy. So I made one bad box. Took it back to get Rita's approval. And uh, it was pretty nasty out there working on the barn. Hot, humid. And then on top of that, throwing sawdust all over you. I don't have the uh, the saw hooked up to a vacuum. And I've got uh, three shop vacs sitting there. 
I could have easily hooked it up. Next time. So after I got the uh, voter approval on the bat box, I went back out. Made two more. Another, another hair over here. Flynn's. I don't know. Flynn, which way are we going? Are we going south again? You don't want to go north? Flynn? Flynn, let's go north. Come. Just like that, the hair disappears. Oh no, there he is. And the mosquitoes are out. Anyway, went back out, made two more bat boxes. And uh, I was going to call it quits. Then I said, eh, let me try my hand on making a bird birdhouse. Birdhouse. So I made a birdhouse. I'll try and edit a picture of the birdhouse into here. Along with the bat boxes. Well, bat box, the first one. I don't have pictures of the second and third one. Ah. Oh, it is nasty. I said it before, the only good thing about having this kind of humidity and rain is it keeps dust down on the road. I saw Flynn stalking, I had not seen the rabbit yet, the hare. Navigate through the uh, the minefield here. <laughs> He's walking real slow. There's the hare sitting right there. Disappears. Glenn. No. No. Glenn. <sighs> so that's stuff on the uh, the tree there. That's old man's beard. I think that's a spruce. Yep. It looks like it's doing very good. Yeah, we had a uh, parasite come through oh, five years ago. Spruce budworm kills off the spruce. Thank you, Mom. Glenn? Come on, bud. Thank you, Mom. Anyone around me? I've done a pirouette in a while.
You can barely see beyond two poles. <clears throat> I don't know how far apart these are. I think they're 200 feet, as opposed to the ones on the power line that's 450. What's happening with Ron DeSantis? He's uh, falling behind the polls. I understand he's 30 points behind Trump, even in Florida. And uh, the black gentleman from uh, North Carolina or South Carolina, Tim Scott, he's only polling at 2 or 3 percent. And that joke, Chris Christie, I don't know if he's even polling. dream I was uh, carrying my shotgun some sort of weird shotgun that I could also put a Ruger 1022 inside the shotgun for carrying purposes which makes no sense whatsoever and uh, I had my AR-15 and we were at some place shooting and uh, unloaded the magazine of the AR-15 trying to saw down a uh, stump which didn't go well you need more than 30 rounds another reason why you need high capacity magazines you want to cut down a stump I remember my brother Tom's who we were shooting his AR. We had a target set up and behind the target. We actually cut down a, uh, a birch for all the, uh, the rounds we put down range. So let's go. Come. Well, it's even worse going looking back down the road. Let's go. Let's come on. <clears throat> That's what Flynn woke me up. I was shooting the uh, Ruby 1022. <clears throat> it's very interesting, I know. Let's 
başka başka. <clears throat> he took care of business last night when we went out for a walk around seven. So probably not gonna happen this morning. <clears throat> See if we can get up to the power lines here and see if we can see one power line. Uh, we can see one, it's only like 200 feet up the road. Yep. Let's see if we can see two. Yep, we can see two. I cannot see three. So, 200, 450, 650. And you lose sight after 650. Flynn. Flynn. Let's go back to the house. some point we have to go to town and get some black paint spray paint to uh, paint the back boxes because uh, they say you should have black paint and I didn't know but you really shouldn't mount them on trees so I'm thinking about putting on the uh, utility pole And have it looking south. It's really warm from the sun. We'll get the basket what they need. flowers up the road a little bit. They started getting buzzed by a bee and he uh, he jumped out of there. He got stung two years ago on the, on the paw. He walked on one and stung him. <coughs> 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 Tree work in the morning. Uh, had to go back out there and put the tools away, clean up the sawdust. Made a lot of sawdust. <coughs> I don't know why, but my uh, compound miter saw, which has a uh, red laser on it. To show you where the blade's going to be. The laser's on, but it's not shining on the uh, suckers you want to cut. I don't know whether there's uh, sawdust uh, clogging something up, but you can see the laser. <clears throat> Uh, 
I'm wondering. I had uh, I had bumped the arm, the bottom arm of the Chisoboli cutting base. I wonder if that knocked the laser out of alignment. They're talking things to her here now and trying to figure out what might have happened. So that might be it. <coughs> to be on a mission to get back home. <clears throat> a little bit of a breeze picking up nice. Oh, I'll take whatever I can get. Once of uh, Flynn and I seen a moose while we're walking. He's got a deer fly on. Flynn, jump. Flynn. I think this is where the hair was before. Yep. He's got that uh, deer fly hovering around him. Flies hovering around me. Where the mosquito? But come on, let's go. <clears throat> and he sees the hair already, 100 feet ahead. <clears throat> I think that's the same one that was out there before, but jumps into the woods. Come on, Flynn. Come on. <clears throat> you can hear the uh, the collected moisture on the trees dripping down. But come. On. I've been up by Rick's to see whether the uh, people from Montana are still there.
had cereal for breakfast yesterday. I'm not sure what I'm going to have today. <sighs> Don't feel like frying up any spam. Although, that would be good on the roll. <clears throat> a little bit of hair down the driveway here. Four. Little guy. Yep. Good boy, let's go to the house. <clears throat> come, come, play. Oh, there's a little breeze again, that's nice. it up for today. Then doesn't deliver. No traffic on the road this morning. Only critters. Hey bud. What are you doing? It's from the house. Come. Thanks for watching.